Hello everybody, this is Mark at KnifeGloves.com uh, putting up a new video demonstrating the brand new part one glove on my website. It is called the Hero. The first nightmare glove is no longer available. Uh, this one is uh, taking its place uh, effective immediately. It's called the Hero because that's the name of the glove that they used in the film, uh, specifically the part one film where uh, it's the glove that had real blades and it was used for up-close shots and whatnot. So, uh, some of the th features are not different. Um, the leather gloves is just a different color, same style. Brass back plate, copper finger stalls, copper finger tips, brass ringlets. Uh, the glove is cut up more authentically. The fingertips are cut off the two middle fingers. Not completely, there's the leather behind it. Uh, the templates are different completely overhauled. The back plate uh, has is not symmetrical. This side is a little straighter, it has a rounded rounded corner. This one is curved and has the pointed corner. If you look at the, the glove in the film you'll notice those little details. Uh, new fingertip templates. Slightly changed templates on the lower finger columns. Not much of a difference. And then the biggest change is probably the blades. Now they're much shorter, they're only about four and a half inches long. They do have the mirroring on it, as you can see there, and also the artificial edging. These blades are not sharp. I will not sharpen my blades, by the way. I get asked that all the time. Uh, these are meant specifically just, just to be props for costumes or display. And I do not want to be held liable for sharpening any of these blades. Plus, they're not the kind of metal that you would want to put a blade edge on. The edge just will not hold very well. So, just a little introduction to the glove. This glove currently is $150. Bucks. I put a ton of work into the research of the templates. You can ask my wife how much time I spent tweaking them and trying to get them as accurate as possible. Uh, the copper is slightly thinner than before. It's a 16 ounce copper. Uh, makes the glove fairly light, uh, but very comfortable to wear. Just thought I'd show it off here. You can hear it. You can close your hand a lot better than the previous gloves. If you've seen my other videos, you can definitely notice the difference in the finger mobility. Can close the hand a lot better. But that's the little demo of the Hero Glove. Hopefully, you stop by my website, knifegloves.com, and drop me an email if you have any questions. Or if you want a glove for yourself, go ahead and place an order. Appreciate you looking. Thank you.